Hey there Arconiacs, this video will contain some behind the scenes photos and videos. They are only a few seconds long, but in case you don't want to see any of that, turn away, click off the video, because we've got some theories to make. As I said, we have some behind the scene photos and videos for the upcoming season of Only Murders in the Building, most of which focuses on the beautiful Selena Gomez in a wedding dress. Some of these photos were released by Steve Martin on Twitter and Selena Gomez via her Instagram. The rest were by people who happened to be near the set while they were filming. I decided why not come up with some crazy theories with little to no context of what's happening. So what do we know? Selena is a queen and anyone would be lucky to marry her. But we also know that the trio appear to be leaving the Arconia in a rush trying to get people out of a taxi so they can get to their destination, assumedly it has something to do with this wedding dress, wherever that may be. So let's jump to some conclusions. First, is this meant to be real and Mabel had plans to marry someone? If so, who would it be? If it was anyone, I would think that it should be Oscar, Mabel's love interest from season one. He was absent from season two and character wise, it's kind of understandably so, but it seemed very abrupt. I understand that he had just gotten out of prison for the murder of Zoe and he was trying to turn his life around. He wasn't keen on Mabel looking into the death of Tim Kono and seeing Mabel in the spotlight being questioned for Bunny's murder wasn't anything that he wanted to be around. So I get why he would want to be as far away from that as possible. The two seem like a good couple to me, and it would be very romantic gesture for him to come back professing his love and asking her to marry him. But I don't think she would say yes. Oscar coming back and the two possibly getting married is highly unlikely, but not as unlikely as Mabel marrying Alice, her love interest from season two where at the end Mabel definitively told Alice that they were not getting back together and she just wasn't trusted in that way. This would have to be a new person that Mabel met within the last year that we have yet to see. And if it's anyone, I would put my money on Ben Glenroy. Though there was nothing at the end of season two that hinted that there was a relationship between the two, the teaser did show the two talking inside Mabel's apartment, and it seemed to me that the two were kind of close. Mabel isn't a part of the stage show, and narratively, we don't have any reason for the two to be talking, at least not yet. I think that it's very likely that the two hit it off in the year that we missed, because Paul Rudd doesn't age, he can play someone a little bit closer to Mabel's age, and I think at this point she's probably about 30 or 31. Getting to know each other after a year and really connecting could lead the two to deciding to get hitched. Sadly, I don't think it's very likely though either. Not all shows, but this one seems to be mostly filmed in order and Mabel in a wedding dress seems like something you would catch in the season finale, or at least the penultimate episode. This would tell us that this most likely takes place after Ben Glenroy was murdered, and though it could be a part of a flashback, I don't think that it is. As much as I wish that it was Theo, I find it unlikely to be him or anyone else that we know either. So it would be someone we have likely never met. I don't feel as if Mabel would do such a thing, nor would Selena agree to her character marrying someone out of the blue that she had only known for a year. At the end of the day, I'm going to say that this is part of a real proposal or idea of a wedding, and I'll explain in a little bit. But if not, why would she be wearing a wedding dress? Could it be part of one of Oliver's shows? Maybe, but we have only seen Mabel in the audience, and she has never shown any interest in acting in a serious capacity. But she has showed interest in acting in order to draw out a killer. Welcome to our killer reveal party. My best guess that this isn't any sort of dream sequence or flashback or anything, but attempt to get the killer to confess. I think that Ben Glenroy and Mabel had a relationship, but this person killed Ben out of jealousy. I think that it will take the trio a while to figure out who this is, but once this person proclaims their love for Mabel, Oliver gives Mabel a dress that he had from one of his past shows, and they use Mabel as bait to get the killer to admit to what they've done. 
it's a little bit out there, but that's my theory. Why do you think Mabel was wearing a wedding dress? Other than me, who do you think she should marry? Let me know down below. Thank you for watching. My name is Dallas, and I'll catch you on the rooftop.